All right, town hall. I guess I should just go visit Laura as well. I do need the food. I haven't seen a source of water for a while now. Give me all the water. Ten bottles. Beautiful. Hold on. Is that piano coming from this building? I think it is. It sounds like it's not in the soundtrack, but actually, like, coming from here? This building isn't marked on the map. Right? Well, wait, kinda. What is this building? I'm scared. Could be stealing from people to do anything here? Is there someone here? Bella? There's a peculiar smell outside. What is it? I don't know, but yeah, it was them playing the piano. Oh, that's so cool. I'm glad I noticed that. Did you see who it was? I didn't see anyone. It was Mother's favorite melody. Her favorite. I think she wrote it herself. No one else could have learned it. Because she only played it for me and no one else. Ever. Not even for Brother. It's List, the, the composer? Impossible. Whatever you say. I hear this melody often. I walk down the street and it comes from a window or from a backyard, an attic, a cellar. I chase the sound, trying to locate the source. I always find the piano, lid raised. Someone has been there, but there's no one. No matter how hard I call. Mysterious. It's driving me mad. I've walked the whole town back and forth. I've worn three pairs of shoes to rags. Do you understand? Three. I'm serious. I wander at night, hoping to hear her, hoping to find whoever plays her melody. Who, who could know Mother so well? I won't believe it was her. Well, I've... I've heard the music, too, so if it honestly weren't you... What if it really was her spirit? Would that mean there's no death, after all? But that's not even the point. I need to know for sure. Any answer would be a gift. It was her music, after all. Our music. If it's just some person playing, some person who was close to Mother, how could they do such a thing to me? If I ever hear this melody again, I'll try to figure it out. Oh, strange. Sometimes a melody can be heard in ordinary houses that only Victoria... Um... Olgumskaya and her daughter knew. If I find the mysterious musician, I can tell Capella about them. Okay. Keep an ear out. For piano. Hold on. Do I need to... Give something to Capella? Aren't they in danger? <clears throat> yeah, they're listed as in danger. Doesn't that mean they need to be given medicine to um, up their protection? Immunity? But they don't need it. Maybe it's just because they're not in an infected district right now?
Wait, am I going backwards? No, 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 that's the right way. Herb. Are you with a child? I... What? No. Apologies, I thought you brought in a baby. Oh, I think I... <laughs> I saw somebody post a picture of this exact dialogue right here on Twitter, talking about how it's one of the most amazing, like, written pieces of dialogue ever, because of how it changes the meaning just with the emphasis of the words, using the exact same words. You thought I brought in a baby? You thought I brought in a baby? You thought I brought in a baby? <laughs> you thought I brought in a baby? Do you visit infected houses during your work? Normal, abandoned, infected, you name it. The mistress decreed, everyone who rescues an infant from an infected house is to bring it here. Such a dangerous feat won't go unrewarded. An infant? I've never seen an infant in the entire game. Do they exist? Got it. If I ever find one, I'll bring it here. Whoever rescues a baby from an infected district and brings it to the town hall will be rewarded. They got cribs all set up for him. Okay. Are the game developers fucking with me when they keep putting people too f like, they keep putting people behind a, a desk of some sort that's too thick for me to be able to talk with them like there's too much distance between me and the person on the other side it happens here and it also happens at the bar Stamatin's bar like look I can't I can't talk with them I have to go around your behavior is ridiculous stop playing detective and start tending to the sick shut the fuck up we need to set up the f facilities an isolation ward, a real hospital. We need control over corpse disposal. Tell me, how is it possible this town has never had a proper hospital? Don't women give birth here? Don't people get sick? I'm serious. Can I help you somehow? No, not now. Though, can you tell me what's going on with their water delivery system? Is it true the water is only for industrial purposes? Seriously. Why do you ask? No reason. Hopefully those are only silly rumors. Forget it, brah. I have a splitting headache. If you have no urgent business, then we'll talk later. Later, later. Queen non proficiat deficit? I would look up what that means, but I mean, it's the bachelor saying it, so fuck them. Not worth the time. Fair enough. Good luck, Emshin. manager. Dr. Baruch, right? Here's your allowance for today. What allowance? Yesterday, the rulers have established the fund for outbreak control. Until the centralized workings of the town's institutions can be restored, every acting doctor will receive a daily allowance. The size of this allowance depends on the end results of your deeds. Today's portion is your advance. Who exactly will be judging my results? I'm just a messenger here. Such are the rules the rulers have decided upon. The money you receive is a budget for buying medicine and other supplies you'll need for working with the infection. 
This system should last us until a centralized distribution system gets arranged. So what is expected of me? First off, you have to attend the hospital every day. It's housed in the building of the theater. I know. Hospital attendance is mandatory and should be your highest priority. If you fail to complete your daily assignment, the fund will deny you any payment for that day, including rewards for other activities. Okay, activities such as... Helping the infected in the streets. The ones stumbling around are beyond salvation, but if you see someone lying on the ground and shuddering, consider giving them a pill. Even a wrong antibiotic helps somewhat. Oh, so that's like the practical benefit to doing that? Of course you should do it just to help the people, but yeah, you do get something from it. <clears throat> How do wrong pills help? They don't reduce infection. They provide care and hope. It's not just the plague that's killing the town, but the panic too. If your pill doesn't help with the former, at least it alleviates the latter somewhat. Although correctly administered antibiotics will be rewarded more generously. Got it. What else is rewarded? Assisting Bachelor Dankovsky, of course. I knew it. Everything has to be about him, doesn't it? Last but not least, the heads of the families, the Keynes in particular, understand that the situation might require you to go beyond the norms of the law. Be warned, however, your good name across town will also be taken into account when calculating your daily allowance. This whole thing's rather complicated. You really have time to manage all this bullshit? Alright, where do I sign? Take the money, it's in the cabinet. The final score is tallied at midnight, so the subsidy for yesterday will wait for you from midnight on. The fund works round the clock, so don't be shy. Huh, that must be why you sound like a talking cash register. That's really good. 2,000 coin and a shit ton of food. Canned food. Uh, hold on, I should loot everything so that time stops passing. I don't have room for this. Oh, I can, I can make room. Canned food. Filling, although I'm not sure what kind of food is inside. Before I returned to the town, I grabbed a whole sack of canned food. Survived on it for almost a week. I can hardly stand the smell now. Let's try eating the canned food just to free up a lot of inventory space. I'm assuming it's going to restore a lot of hunger just because it's so big. Yeah, that was really good. About half a bar. Just got a shit ton of supplies back here. Drums and barrels and boxes and stuff. Oh yeah, this is the jail down here. Do they have that person they took in for my father? I think that's them right there. I'm dying. Is that the same suspect that we just talked to? Because if it is, then they... got real fucked up real fast. What's wrong with you? The sand plague. Keep your distance. And don't blame yourself. Just find your father's real killer and I can die peacefully. My god, they went downhill fast. I will end them. You can be sure of that. Sorry, buddy. How are we doing on time? About 12.30. Let's go to Laura's. Thought 
there were a bunch of birds overhead. I think it was just a bunch of leaves. Water for a tourniquet? At this point, I don't know. I want to brew a lot of things, and finding places that actually dispense water is getting harder. I do have a shit ton, though. But then again, tourniquets suck. Metal scrap. I think I want that, actually. I remember yesterday there was something I wanted to repair for the kids, but I didn't have the metal scrap to do it. Grindstone and a chisel. You're the raisin kid, aren't you? Blech. Respected here. I've already got some coffee, so let's not do that. Kasha could be good as always. A fingernail and a match for a Kashik. It is my only match. <laughs> eh, let's do it. Smoked fish. Hmm. Don't have good stuff to trade for it. Mm, they trade very poorly for walnuts. And look at this wall of sand pests just right there. Jesus Christ. Oh, you pay very well for fingernails. Can I get a fingernail end? Do I even want immunity boosters? Aren't they just like vastly inferior tinctures? Do I want to totally overtrade for a fingernail? Sure. I'm like people here like me more. Or was supposed to. I didn't actually see anything happen. A needle for some soap. Heck yeah. can have them repair the fabric. Apparently it's damaged imperceptibly. Hope that's not an issue in crafting. Oh, wait, is this not the place? Oh, I'm right next to Lara's place. Heron. Forget it. It's broken. Broken. They've destroyed water pumps all over the town, the villains. The Gorkin water's foul, sure, but we don't drink it. Oh, what about washing? Cleaning? It's fine when boiled. Cholera dies in boiled water. Who broke it? Hell if I know. People have turned to wolves now. Packs of wolves. Some destroy water pumps, others look for the carrier. Some stock up on kerosene, planning to burn houses. Everyone has their own truth. I also heard of a suicidal toglore. They don't wait for death. Too scared. Wait, what's a toglore again? What toglore? Well, it's like a community. A step word. I don't know the details. <clears throat> I know what a tug lore is. Would you describe a psychosis? Also, apparently a tug lore is a group of people who share a common fate. Takes a lot of stuff to repair that. It's 
a person over here by the tree? Nope. Is it worth trying to loot the house again? Oh god, yes it is. Oh my god. This stuff is amazing. This is, this is really good. I don't have room for that, obviously. I will make room for that gladly. Is that, no. Two by two? Oh my god, that's, no, no, it's way bigger than two by two, it's huge. I need to upgrade my window so bad. I'm gonna do it really, really, really soon. I'm just gonna drop the toolkit just so I can take this bread and eat it because it's so fucking huge. Never throw bread on the ground. If you're full, give it to a friend. No friends, give it to an enemy. Hell, give it to a dog, just don't waste it. This is very filling. My hunger's at halfway. Could it be more filling than halfway? No, not quite. So it does about half a bar. Now I don't have room for that. Shit. Uh, two by twos of this will work. What if I just took the food and then just didn't talk to them? <laughs> I always hope they don't have more because then I'm just going to be like, God, where do I put it? Why aren't we preparing for evacuation? Cub, I'm in trouble. Have you heard about the water? Well, I can guess. I've been around the town after all. We're running out of water. They won't carry in more from the steppe springs because of the quarantine. And last night, someone sabotaged the water pumps. The remaining barrels are all we have. Do you understand? Sabotage the water pumps? Why? Because the abattoir dumps its waste into the gorkin. But the pumps take water from the gullet and the guzzle. They're more clear. Uh, but today, a rumor spread that the pumps were producing muddy water because someone allegedly dumped corpses into the tributaries. More nonsense. The cemetery isn't far, and it's spacious. We have plenty of room for the dead. For now, anyway. Things are bad, cub. God knows when the water barrel will return to the steppe. Those barrels are all we have, and they'll be guarded. Each person is only allowed one bottle. There's a water pump next to your house. Want me to fix it? No, I mean... Yes, it would be nice of you, but that's not what I need. Why? I need drinking water. Lots of it. Pumps really aren't a good source, Cub. Whatever they say, now is not the time to take risks. How much is lots? Listen, I want to provide a place for the healthy people who have lost their homes. A home for the living. My house is on the outskirts, so the plague wouldn't reach us here. But this isn't feasible without drinking water. I've always respected you. Grovel? <laughs> Grovel? Gravel? Laura? Ravel? Gravel? Is that like a... I think we've referred to them like that once before. I'm assuming it's like a pet name. I've always respected you, Grovel, and my respect just grew. Father would approve. I suppose he would, yes. I'll need water, plenty of water. Get me a barrel, Cub, please. Have it delivered here. You're a doctor. You have special authority. But you said yourself they're guarded. No one would just give me one. In the middle of town, it's Ogimsky's people who will guard the water. Just tell them. They'll listen. 
please, sweet cub, I beg of you. It's not selfish, it's for a good cause. Those poor survivors. No one else cares for the homeless. Please? Well, I'll see what I can do, but I'm not sure. Very noble. Good idea. Just curious if there's anything up here. <laughs> okay. So, is that what the quest says specifically? Laura wants to turn her shelter into a, well, shelter for the homeless. To do that, she needs a personal water barrel. I should look for one in the middle town, in the spleen, the maw, the backbone, and so on. Okay, and Lara said it would be guarded by Olgimsky's people, which means I should see people around it, guarding it. Middle town, spleen, maw, backbone. Is that just... Ma, spleen. Backbone. So Middletown is just like quite literally this whole center spot, I guess. And they're talking about Olgimsky, so it would just be around Olgimsky's place, right? Okay, you know what time it is? It's time to take a boat back to my lair and upgrade my freaking inventory. Is it infected here? Fuck it is. Oh, hey. Wait a second. I should say... I should say... Howdy, partner. Can't talk to them. Goodbye, partner. Okay, yeah, no. That better not be real. Scared? I'm just estimating how they're gonna look. Don't you worry, for now. For now, they're still right as rain. But the countdown has started, so to speak. They're the most delicious piece to me. The most interesting morsels. What do you want? I only want to play hide-and-seek. I am, after all, playing with you all. Hide-and-seek. Tag. Dice. Tic-tac-toe. Love my X's and O's. So keep in mind, ready or not, here I come. Where's the eighth? The eighth will be a hassle, but I think I'll manage in nine days or so. Maybe faster. Who knows? I'll be faster. The fuck was that? The patients on my list are under threat. price of salt is going up. People are hoarding it. It's like we're at war. Maybe the herbs are wrong, but old man used these ones. But I guess I don't remember them all. What the hell are you doing? What do you want from me? Can't you see I'm making a cure? 
for freckles? <laughs> Do you live under a rock or something? An alarm rang across the whole town. Only you and deaf folks haven't heard about the sand plague yet. A cure needs to be made. It, but what's the word? A panacea? I know all that. Old man can make any cure. A piece of this, a piece of that, an herbal tincture. He fixed everything, from dislocated joints to the blues. Yes, I could use a cure for the blues now. I mean, you're in no hurry, right? So I'll make the cure myself. I remember some things. Maybe like a poultice at least, so it wouldn't burn so bad. <clears throat> You know, perhaps the burning is fine, if it helps someone survive. So, what's the plan? Did you lose your tongue? The plan... The plan is this. Do you know what a serum is, kid? I do. It's the thing that makes people tell the truth. So imagine a person gets infected, right? Their body begins fighting the sickness, creates antibodies. So now what? Where do we start? With father's apparatus over there. The big one, I mean. I can't brew anything while it's broken, but I don't have a toolkit either. That's not true. I do have a toolkit. <laughs> hey, I know where we can get a toolkit. I'll get it for you. I mean, for us. There's this place in the atrium, and this guy who owes me. But I'll need your help, all right? The box is heavy. I can't carry it on my own. Um, I guess I just don't need to do that. I have a toolkit. Turns out you are of help. I think we'll get along just fine. Where did it add a thing? Did it? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Someone owes Sticky a toolkit over there. Okay, cool. I mean, I'm sure I'll need a toolkit for something else in the future, right? Just glad I don't actually need it. The bacteria live in infected organs, meaning I can extract a serum from them. A tincture mixed with an infected organ. I'll have to get them on my own from infected bodies. And I'll have to try different organs. Great. There we go. Oh, it, oh man, this thing can be fixed up a lot more. It's going to work now, but I actually need another toolkit to fix it more. Okay, hold on. Let's upgrade my inventory. Um, how much is that going to increase my space by? By eight pieces. That's pretty good. To do it again, I need... Oh man, it gets more expensive. You need a thimble. Most of... Well, forget those things. Those are easy. But you need that, like, fine toolkit type thing for clothes and the better cloth. What's this for? Oh, this is just to repair stuff in general. So I can use this thing now, huh? Yeah, I can mix organs with tinctures. Or blood with tinctures? Oh dear god, I should not mess with this thing before I look at all these pictures and put them all on and figure out exactly what they mean. <laughs> hmm. Well, you know what? How about I go do that? I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far. And... When I return, I will have collected all these images and tried to use them to figure out what they all mean. Hey, Tumblr human. <laughs>